Russ Evans for the Under the Hood Radio Show here, where we give you advice for free on how to fix things automotive, like this. Battery cable ends. How many times have you looked at your battery and seen all that foamy mold looking stuff growing on the end of your terminals or they just won't tighten down anymore so you're thinking i'll just cut them off right and we'll bolt on some of these aftermarket terminals they got them in all sorts of different designs for you to get you fixed up well do you really want to do that here's what can happen if you can cut off the end of the cable and you have enough room to do so and it's clean and brand new and shiny kind of looks like this one inside on the end there you can see the metal and it's not corroded at all, you may be good to do so. Go ahead and get yourself these ends. They're usually just a few bucks. But if the cable is corroded inside where it's hidden, you cut that back a little bit and you'll see this cable end to end is shot. That's when you want to replace the whole cable. Aftermarket, this is from a Honda, from an Accord. They do make complete cable assemblies. You can get them from the dealer. They're going to cost you a ton of money. But you can get them aftermarket, and they make them really nice. The ones we picked up for this last car we worked on were actually a heavier gauge with better connectors than these cheap junk ones that come from factory from Honda. So they gave us a good connection. So that's when you want to replace it. If it's got a lot of corrosion in it, you replace the whole cable. If it's the end of it if you got plenty of room to work with here and you can cut it off and you got good clean end yeah by all means you can get away with that you don't have to take all the cables off the car but in some cases you got to do it this way so that's why you'd want to go with a whole cable instead of just the ends take care and we'll see you guys under the hood